Hey guys, today I'm showing you how to get a black mouse cursor. So it's really easy and really simple. So all you need to do is you want to go to Google Chrome and you want to go into this website. Um, and you've got the link right here to download it. So uh, before you do that, I'm going to show you that actually you can get uh, a black uh, mouse cursor without downloading anything by just going into your settings. But it does look it look like it does make it look like Windows Vista, and I'm gonna show you what I mean. So if I go to my settings and I go to ease as access um, mouse settings, and I set black. So here I got white and black, and I got the black one. As you can see, here's the normal white one. As you can see, um, it looks like a Windows Vista. And I'm going to show you what I mean. And I'm on Windows 10. So I'm going to go here into um, Control Panel. And if I go right here onto. No, wait. Control Panel. I don't want to right click it. I don't know, but what I know. Here, I'll show you. Here, I'll show you that I actually am running Windows 10. I know some people don't believe me because, I mean, look at that. Um, I am win running Windows 10. So if I go in here and click on Specky, Specky's is a software that shows you what you're running on your computer. And here are my operating system on Windows 10 64 bit, um, which as Windows 10, but. Uh, yeah, so all you need to do is you have to go again to, to this link. I'm going to put it down in the description, and you want to download it. And I'm going to show you that this actually does work by going to a different website. So, dwippeat.com. So here I'm gonna do um, mouse cursor. Oh, I have one. Here, I have this one. And I'm gonna click on black. Okay, but anyways, so you wanna go ahead and download that. And again, go to that right here. Click on download, and it's gonna go ahead and download right here. I know you just heard something move, but <laughs> here you have it, the uh, Windows 10 uh, cursor. So here we have the preview. So as you can see, it looks much more normal. <laughs> and the window, again, is loading like this. And I don't know if I showed you, but if I do it with this, it looks like, do you guys see that? It looks like a Windows Vista. So uh, see that loading? Um, so that how it's loading and i'll show you after what it looks like before so here all we have to do is we have to click how to install is i'm going to show you how we want to scroll all the way down and click on install and if you got do you want to open this file go and click on open uh i don't know, publisher everything's okay but you don't want to do it like this as you can see look at that loading looks like windows do stuff so go and click on right click it and you want to extract it first, and here you've got it extracted, and you want to go ahead again and right click it and install it, and click on open. As you saw that, it looked like Windows Vista. So once you've got it installed, you want to go ahead, I'm going to go ahead and install this one up, um, and you want to go ahead and go to um, control panel. And I'm going to click on mouse and click on pointers and click on sheen. So go ahead and click on Windows Black because that's how it looked like. And as you can see, this is how it looks like the loading. And click on apply and click on yes. And it looks like a regular one. So here's another one that I have. Looks different. It's much bigger. 
here I have a metric times two and yeah so that's pretty much it I'm gonna go ahead and close this video out but um, um, control panel and mouse and again pointers and I'm going to do it to windows black and apply and it, it does stay like this after you restart it so anyways guys thank you for watching and peace out